Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope you are doing extremely well. This is your very own Mars Coda this side, and today we will be solving the 34th day. What are the plants problem of the day? Okay. So the name of the problem is what are the plants? Let us see what does the problem say. So the problem says that you have been given a gallery that is divided into n parts. And those n parts are mentioned as 0, 1, 2, up till n minus 1. That is 0 based indexing. All right. Clear up till now. Now, it is given to us that at each division, you can attach a sprinkler. I know, I think that you, all of you know a sprinkler. Sprinkler is the one that waters, like it is kind of a fountain. Okay. And at a particular division, you can attach a specific type of a uh, sprinkler. Okay. You can attach an AI range sprinkler. What is the AI range sprinkler? AI range sprinkler is suppose it is at position I right now. So it the maximum it will uh, uh, sprinkle in the left is I minus X. Uh, suppose AI is your X. It will be my minus X. And at right also it will be I plus X. So the range will be I minus AI up to I plus AI. Okay. You have to find the minimum number of sprinklers needed to water the whole field to water all the indexes 0 1 2 up till n minus 1 all right and if it if it is not possible to uh, water whole of whole of the field then return minus 1 that is your base case also if ai is equals to minus 1 that is the x is for x is minus 1 for any sprinkler that means at that index you cannot attach a sprinkler okay you cannot attach a sprinkler i think all the twin conditions are valid for you, are understandable. Now, let us try to answer this question on that base. Okay. So the indexes are 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. The first index, is, the zeroth index is minus 1. So not a, a sprinkler cannot be attached here. For this, 1 minus 2, that is minus 1, up till 1 plus 2, that is 3. These are the indexes which will be water, that are minus 1, 0, 1, 2, 3. All right. For the second one, it is two minus two that is zero plus two plus th two plus two that is four. So zero one two three four. Right. Third, not a sprinkler can be attached because of minus one. Fourth, four minus zero that is four, and four plus zero that is again four. So only fourth index that is this one. Fifth, five minus zero that is five. Five plus zero is five. So only the fifth one. Okay. Now we have to order. From 0, we have to order 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So if you look at this type of graph, how many of the things you see that you will need it? Uh, if I am if I am correct, if I attach only this sprinkler and this sprinkler, that is number 1 and number 2. So my answer should be 2 for this one. So I think that we have got the hang of what we have to do. That is what is our input and what is our output. If you have got it, hit the subscribe button. Okay. Also hit the like button if you have understood up till now and comment below. Okay. Now our approach. So as we did here, our first step was to check out the ranges that are possible for us. So our first step will be check out and make a separate 2D array to store all the ranges possible. This is the first step for both brute force and for optimized approach. So as usual, we will be discussing the brute force approach. Okay, the brute force approach so the brute force approach would be that i have these ranges that is one two three four i will select all the combination of ranges possible that is i will first select only one then only two then only three then only four if i find the answer there return it then one two two three three four 4, 1. Okay. After that, if I find answer there, return it. After that, 1, 2, 3. That is all the 4C3 combinations. Here it was 4C1. 
here it is 4c2 and here it is 4c3 and that last all the ranges as soon as i, 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 I find a, find an answer return that 4c4 so what i'm doing is i'm actually doing 4c1 plus 4c2 plus 4c3 plus 4c4 type uh, ranges combination that is actually 2 to the power 4 minus 1 if you know p and c a bit you will be able to get it so what is the case that nc0 plus nc1 up till ncn is actually 2 to the power n so we are not including 0 here so 0 will be 1 nc0 is 1 so this will give me 2 to the power n minus 1 all right that is written here that is 16 minus 1 computations 15 computations okay so the complexities of 2 to the power n pretty inefficient right as you know space complexity is o of 1 because we are not using any space so pretty inefficient right we have to find an efficient approach what is our efficient approach our efficient approach says that the first step should be to sort all the ranges so our ranges were minus 1 to 3 after that 0 to 4 after that 4 to 4 after that 5 to 5 these were our ranges right my first step says sort the ranges based on the first index that is the zeroth index the zeroth index if you observe the ranges given to us are already sorted order so i'm no need to sort them again but it is not the case for all the ranges we will get in the future test cases so we have to sort them first okay the second step says our initial target is that we are starting watering from 0 and then we will water 1 then we will water 2 then we will water up till n minus 1 okay this this is the flow we are obtaining so what i will do is my target is actually now 0 that my target i have to achieve target 0 i have to water target 0 okay i will say that my i is currently here okay i will see if let me suppose that the ranges are stored in a vector called v if v of i of 0 that is the first element is greater than target suppose there was not minus 1 here it was 1 here and it is sorted it was 1 here and it sorted the first index that means 0 is not being watered by any sprinkler right in that case we have to return minus 1 this is a base case else what you have what you will do else i have to achieve target 0 right so this will target uh, this will target uh, this will be uh, indicating the target of this this is also doing zero this is also doing zero which should i pick among this i should pick this one why because it is covering most range so what i'm doing is until that y let me let me show that int maxi is the current second index that is vi1 then i plus plus moving to the next one now while my i is less than v dot size that is the uh, size of the array of the vector and my v of i of first of zero sorry is actually less than equals to target that is if i'm standing at third position i want to water third position and my vi is actually at zero that means zero will be watering third that is why i'm standing here okay but if it is four then it will not be watering third right so vi is less than equals to zero then what we will do my max c will be updated max c is equals to max of the existing maxi to find the maximum range possible uh, uh, including the target it is it is doing to find maximum range possible including target okay then maxi will be maxi of uh, updated maxi and v of i of 1 that is the second index okay after this you have to also i plus plus here because of the discarding the condition of infinite loop okay after this what we will do my target is now actually maxi plus 1 because maxi is already achieved by that range and my answer will also be incremented that the count of the sprinklers all right so my answer is 0 right now here okay after this while loop uh, if my target is less than n 
less than n minus 1 sorry because the total index is where n minus 1 if my target is less than n minus 1 then return minus 1 as discussed because the loop has already ended and else return answer okay i hope it is clear to you okay now the main step up till when this loop up from this step until this step before if target is less than n minus 1 when will it occur it will occur until we have not achieved a target we have not achieved our target and so first condition is while target is less than n okay and we are not out of range intervals we are not out of available stock of intervals so the and condition will be i is less than v dot size that is intervals dot size okay. time complexity is o of n because you will see that o of n plus o of n log n why n log n because we sorted it in the first step if you can see and o of n because the loop is running o of n times okay space complexity is o of 1 we are not storing anything okay instead of the variables so constant space okay let us code it down real fast so coding would work like the discussion what was the discussion create a vector i'm storing it as a pair because the it is it will be storing only two integers at each index name it as v okay now for int i going from 0 up till n that is the size of the gallery if my gallery of i is equal to equal is not equal to minus one then only i will push right so v dot push back v dot push back uh, gallery i it will be subtract i minus gallery i because of the left range and i plus gallery i all right done we have got our v now my int n my n will become v dot size is v dot size different from the previous n yes because we are discarding the minus ones okay after that sort the gallery array sort gallery dot begin with gallery dot end done what do we have to do after that after that my target is initially zero my i is initially zero that is my pointer that will move and my answer is initially zero the loop will be running up till my target is less than n and i less than target is less than actually that is stored in m okay because i will be requiring n and m both target is less than n and i is less than n i is less than m sorry now if my v of i dot second dot first is actually greater than m uh, is actually greater than target then return minus one because we cannot achieve target uh, in this case else what we have to do my int maxi is equals to v of i dot second and then i plus plus now while i is less than m so that we do not run out of index and uh, v of i is less than equals to target then what do you have to do yeah then what do we have to do uh my maxi will be updated is equals to max of existing maxi with v of i and it will be first here so to mention i forgot to mention first dot second now that is the left right range right after that i plus plus and then my target will become maxi plus one and my answer will be plus plus okay now if my target is less than n minus one that is whole lot whole lot is not watered in that case return minus one else return your current answer that we have calculated let us try to combine it on it meanwhile please hit the subscribe button it means a lot to me and i hope you would understand there has been an error so we cannot sort gallery we have to sort v sorry i'm typing mistake 
We have to sort the intervals. I have by chance sorted the gallery. Let us try it now. Sorry for my mistake and please subscribe. Okay, running fine from Kapayan and trying out for Summit also. I hope you have clicked something went wrong. Let's try it for Summit again. Done fine. Okay. So as you can see, I complete 34 day streak and I hope you are liking my videos and please, please, please subscribe to it. And please, 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 if you are able to understand the question, please like it and it will give me a lot of, lot of motivation and comment down your doubts. And if you like the video, please uh, comment down the opinions also. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. And please, there is an important update that please join the Discord server. I see many of you are joining, but there are still some people left who are not joining. So join because I have something big to announce there. And hope you like the video. Have a nice day.